Hey everybody, it is evening time here. Uh, Dad and I have been working the whole day. We're very tired. Very tired. Very tired. Back's hurt. We've been doing drywall in the basement. But we just wanted to show you some of the seeds that Dad's got. I might be able to borrow some. It's always fun to work towards this kind of a seed swap situation where everybody's got their own types, everybody's got their own heirlooms that, that they like to share and, and uh, maybe some secret types that you keep back and don't don't just give to everybody, <laughs> you know, just for family. And, um, but I, I think it's fun to save your own seed. And is some of this some you've saved, or Not is it all new stuff? This is all new is stuff. it heirloom stuff? So we'll see what he likes from this, and then maybe save some of those seeds. But yeah, we're just gonna chat about it and see what we got going on here. I was like, I hope these are okay. I kept them in the garage in Ohio. It was yeah. cold so until today. And this to keep it airtight or whatever. So, do you know where they come from? I ordered them online from a place. I had a hard time finding them. Yeah. Um, all the heirloom, non GM, all the stuff I want seemed like they were all uh, either not selling yet or they were sold out. Or this year's been pretty, pretty crazy with seeds because all the COVID stuff, everybody just got outside and wanted to plant, so. So I got these. Yeah. I can't remember the name of the place. Probably on there. Uh, Heavenly Seed. Heavenly Seed. They're in Anderson, South Carolina. They were very prompt. Got me everything, everything that I wanted. So I was very pleased. The prices were good. I thought it was good. Here's what I have. What I want to do, I'm going to make a deal. So you choose the ones that you will plant. Spinach, blue seed spinach. Uh, yeah, let's do that. And there's a lot of seed in these packets, man. They gave me yeah, they're good stuff. That's good. I like this company. Early prolific straight neck summer squash. Those are good. They are good. You, you, they won't cross pollinate with the other squash. Yeah, well, they will. Or is it are you trying to save seed back? I kind of do, but let's. You, you won't use. I'll try. Them. I'll try to work towards seeing what I can uh, plant in yeah. succession. Plant to where. They're not going to be blooming at the same time. All right, here's peas. Piggot peas. P i g g o t t. You probably won't eat any of them because they'll be ready early. Oh, mm -hmm. But you won't, you won't have time to plant them. Wheat. Uh, and they're oh, early. Okay. Or they'll spring. But won't they keep for until next year? Yeah. Keep them yeah. Hundred percent. Yeah. Uh, bell pepper. Yeah. I love a good bell pepper. Time to get those going. Oh really? You start those early, just like. Uh, Black eyed peas. Like tomatoes and eggplant. Black eyed peas. Yeah, they're, they're good. All right. And a snow pea. No, it's too late, right? We can start them, but, but I don't know if you're going to get it. Let's do this next year. Okay. 
Anytime I say you're not gonna eat it, you're like, no, no, no. You're a, a bunching onions. Those are good, but are they hard to start? But uh, yeah, they're a little finicky on the, on the start. And I could try them, but uh, might be something. That's something you can start up in Ohio. Let's, all right, let's keep those there. Uh, Lessonado kale. Okay. I like, I like kale a lot. You'll do it. Like I've never heard of that kale though. Oh, but I love kale. Eggplant. Black beauty eggplant. Yeah. Time to start. That's those. a lot. You have enough room for all this. There's a lot Good of news. food here. I might not need to buy seeds. This cantaloupe, but I won't put it in there. Same reason the honey do. Right? Yeah, it takes much space. Masculine, masculine mix. Masculine mix. Those are nice. Yeah. How much seeds in there? Pretty good. Uh, loose leaf lettuce. Those are good. This is good. Mm -hmm. I like to combine those sometimes with the muscular mix. Leeks? Mm -hmm. No. I don't want a leaky garden. Uh, uh, Simpson leaf, leaf lettuce. We got plenty of lettuce there, right? I mean, leaf lettuce is good. Either, either, way, either way you want to go. Use what you want and then. Keep back so I don't think you'll need all this. It's a lot. No, all of it. Here's Russian kale, red kale. But yeah, yeah, we got other type of kale too. So it's two types. It might be all I need as far as seed goes. How, much, right. how much did you spend you, on all this guy? Uh, Ninety-three dollars. Wait, I'm not the root. Yeah, whoa. Cucumbers. Yeah. There's two kinds of cucumbers. You want me to plant all this, or you want to plant all this? I want you to plant something. I, don't, I can't this year, but I'm gonna save yeah. some back. I don't use them all. I'll plant them next year. Yeah. Uh, Muncher cucumbers and Arkansas little leaf cucumbers. So which one? Let's do the Let's do the Muncher ones. Uh, uh, collards. Uh, let's save those for fall. We'll save them. Uh, celery. Fall. Spring. Fall. Spring. Fall. Spring. I've never actually oh. planted celery before. Well, I have once. Uh, you, when really? we were in Kenya, we used to grow it. It grew so well. It was so good. Wow. It was a little white. Um, pole beans, greasy, cut short. I think I, I got a bunch of pole beans of my own that I saved back from Trail my of Tears garden. Pole. Cherokee Trail of Tears Pole. It didn't say pole what? Pole, pole beans, I guess. Not pole beans. I look at the seeds. Oh, wait. Artichokes. Wait, let me feel the seed back it. I'm tell you. That's, yeah, beans. Okay. Artichoke and asparagus. Nope, nope. Ooh, asparagus takes two years. Those, those are good, but you yeah, different. Look at this. Yeah, not in here. Oh, I guess. This is. Peas. Sweet peas. English peas. Wando English. Look at all of them. Wow. That's awesome. I, I might need to buy some stuff from these folks. All right. You want to wait on these or you see so? Yeah, I'll wait on those. Well, yeah, let's put some in here. Oh, we'll get a few out. It doesn't more. take much. All right. Did you see all I got in this? This is huge. Look that's at, awesome. That's too much. For about a hundred dollars. Think about how much. Three dollars. Honestly, that's cost savings. Thing. Once you plant it in the ground and then grow it. Oh, that's. You can save so much. This is eating up. You'll eat all summer food. and fall. Yeah. And you'll put some up. If you planted all of this, you probably need a. You need a whole you need a quarter acre. A whole <laughs> at least quarter, if not half. Well. I got too much. Yeah, about, about a quarter. It's really good. I did a good job. They gave me a list of everything I had. That's what's nice about How much it costs. It's seeds good. is they'll save. You don't have to use them all at once. It's not one time. Good. A really nice note came with it. A letter from them. Yeah, nice. And even they wrote on there, thank you, Mike, and 1 Corinthians 15, 1 through 2 is written on there. Oh, man. Yeah, that's nice. Cool folks. All right, so. I'm going to have to go meet them someday. Yeah. Anyway. Cool. So that's it. Well, good. If you plant those or some of those, and we get to eat some of it too, I'm happy. 100%. Keep some of the seed back. We got. I'll keep this. How do I store the seed that I don't use? Well, you, best way. You wanna, you wanna make sure that it's not just suffocated, so it doesn't have any air. You want some air that access. So like it had had that bag around it. Careful to put bag for for too long, of course. Okay. You want to be able to have air, but also not any dampness. Um, and you don't want it to be too hot or too cold. Well, cold is not really much of an issue, but too hot. So pretty much like a pantry situation. Put them in a, in a paper bag. They're actually the best. I like that they're using paper. Mm -hmm. 
you can use plastic, but it, it just uh, doesn't work quite as well because the paper works to keep it dry. Cool stuff. So I like them again. What's the name of the company again? Um, I don't remember what it is. I'll look at them again on the receipt. And so it's uh, a. Yeah. Probably on the, I lost on the, the purchase little tag. Oh, yeah, here it is. Oh, need my glasses. So it's a Heavenly Seed Company in Anderson, South Carolina. I just got them online. Nice. On the so, Heavenly Seed Company, Heavenly Seed. Anderson, South Carolina. They're great. Mike Watkins. Awesome. Watkins. Mike Watkins is there. Yeah. Anyway, awesome. first time you use them, but I'm pleased. Yeah, we'll see how they turn out. I'll give you some peace. Sweet. 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 But yeah, folks, getting seeds is fun. I do have some favorite companies that I like to order from. I've never had these folks, but I'm um, still planning on doing a video on the different types of companies that I like the best. Some of those companies are, are currently not shipping because they're so backed up. But I'll still mention them because I think that they're they're going to get a better better. Uh, um, inventory this year and then be able to provide for everybody but uh, yeah there's there's definitely some good better best companies out there i think yeah It'd be good to get some tips on that you see how well these germinate too yeah no, I, 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 I imagine they are but there's a, yep good, good i can't wait to eat i know so too. tomorrow i'll get out and get can't wait to see the garden getting green and not just oh, having mulch out there. And today was gorgeous. Oh we, we were inside all day working all on day. The, the sheet rock. It I was like 60 exhausted. something degrees outside. Oh, and sunny. Oh, it was a nice day. Man. You either want to go to the garden or go fishing. Yeah. I'm getting I'm getting that fishing bug. I want to get out there. But I appreciate Daddy. He came out here. And, you know, I had never done sheet rock before, so he helped me learn how to do it. And we knocked out most of it. Got a little bit more. Most of it. Well, thank you, son. Good. Looking forward to having a good garden. A whole bunch of potential right there. Yeah. Awesome. Well, y'all have a good one. We'll see you next time on the Garden Guy channel, and let's keep sowing and growing. Sowing, literally. Mm -hmm. Good stuff.